International Public Health. Hi, in this part we talk about a concept called burden of disease, which describes death and loss of health due to diseases, injuries and risk factors for all regions of the world. We can measure burden of a disease by DALI, which stand for Disability Adjusted Life Year. By using DALI, we can decide about how to use resources on different diseases. DALI can be measured by adding year of life lost to year of life disabled, and one DALI is equal to loss of one year of life, which could be lived in full health. So, we can measure DALI for different diseases in different regions of the world to understand their burden. Let's say you have $100,000 and need to decide if using it on combating malaria in India or on diabetes type 2 in Canada. And the calculation of DALI shows 74 in India and 163 in Canada. And you might decide to donate your $100,000 to the NGO who is helping people with diabetes in Canada. You may also hear about double burden of disease or triple burden of disease. Let's have an example to know these terms better. In this graph, you can see the trend of communicable and non-communicable diseases plus accidents in a developing country in Asia. As you see, from 1960 to 1980, the communicable diseases were the leading causes of deaths in this period. But after economic growth and urbanization, non-communicable diseases started to increase. So, at some points, prevalence of both type of diseases were high, and we can call it double burden of diseases. And if we had also a high level of mortality due to injuries, substance abuse, and mental illness, it creates the triple burden of disease. Thank you for listening.